Hello students, in this video we shall discuss question number 3 of exercise 2.4. Factorize the following using appropriate identities. There are in total 3 problems here. The first one is 9x squared plus 6xy plus y squared. We need to factorize this given expression using identities. And for this we are going to use the identity a plus b the whole squared. We see here that there is a plus sign and a plus sign. So that's why we are using this identity. Also there is a square here and there is a square here. So a plus b whole squared equals to a squared plus twice a b plus b squared. Now compare these and we need to get it in this form. These are the factors, right? So 9x squared we can write as 3x the whole squared plus 2 a and b. So as of now we can just leave it like this plus b squared. b is y squared. So here we will fill in what is a and what is b. a is 3x, b is y. We can check. 2 times 3 is 6, 6xy. That's what we have got here. Which equals to a plus b whole squared. That means 3x plus y the whole squared. And we can write this as 3x plus y into 3x plus y. So these are the factors of this given polynomial. Second one. 4y squared minus 4y plus 1. Here there is a minus sign and a plus sign. So we will use the identity a minus b the whole squared which equals to a squared minus 2ab plus b squared. Minus sign plus sign. Minus sign plus sign. Now we will compare these and we will try to get this polynomial in this form. So a squared is what? 2y the whole squared because 2y into 2y is 4y squared minus 2 leave these two as of now plus b squared 1 so we can write 1 as 1 squared so this is a and this is b we will write 2y and 1 we can check 2 2's are 4 4 1's are 4 so 4y 4y equals to 2y minus 1 the whole squared. We got it in this form and we will just write it twice now. 2y minus 1 into 2y minus 1. And this is your answer for the second one. Third and the last one x squared minus y squared by 100. Here we got a minus sign and two squared terms. So we are going to use the identity a squared minus b squared which equals to a plus b into a minus b. So for this first we will write it as x squared minus y squared by 100 is equal to x squared minus y by 10 squared. Okay now if this is in this form so that would be equal to x plus y by 10 and x minus y by 10. And these are the factors for this given polynomial. Hope this is clear to all. Thank you.